Hey Bubba, I wish I could come watch you tonight. You know I miss you a lot, but Gail's a Nazi, so I'm here practicing instead. I do work. Um, I know you've had a really rough couple of months with your knee surgery and all your rehab and all that crap, um, but you really showed a lot of dedication to your team and they really come first for you and I think that's really cool about you. Um, like when we went to your game in the middle of the winter at Town & Country and we were looking for Gail and I had to carry you up the stairs on my back because you were crutching around and you knew you wouldn't get recruited and all you were there just to support your team and your friends um, just because and for no other reason. That's really special about you. Um, <laughs> and I liked carrying you up the stairs, that was interesting. Um, I'm really proud of you. You work really hard and you're really tough. And even though I act like I'm stronger than you because I can hold you off of a ball, it's like no big deal. Um, <laughs> I really, you really are so strong and you work so hard and I really think that's something that runs in our family and I'm proud of you that you carried that on for MND. And, um, and I really miss playing with you. Um, that was something really special and those were two of the best years of my soccer career when I got to play with you every game. Um, and you you have you bring a different thing to a team than I do. You bring fun and you bring your team together and you're obviously hilarious and soldier boy dancing and all that crap. Um, and I really think that's something that I really admire in you is that you can bring your team together like that. Um, be so funny all the time. Um, even though we bitch each other all the time when we were at M&D, at least we could provide entertainment for everyone else. Um, I really love playing with you and seeing you every day and I miss that a lot. Um, when my class graduated, we left a program that was just getting started, and I'm really proud of all of your teammates, but especially you for keeping that tradition going, um, and s starting the tradition, really. Um, I remember we were so excited just to win a game to get us to 500. That was our big moment, and you guys are playing the best teams in the country and the city, and you're ranked all the time. It was big for us when we broke the top 10, so I'm really excited for the program and for you, and I know you're a big part of that, no matter anybody tells you um, ever you know that you're a part of that um, I'm really glad the most you glad that you made the most of your years at MND and you made soccer so much fun for all the people around you um, and I'm just really excited that you've had so much success this year I'm kind of jealous um, and just keep developing that pride for MND and that's to all your teammates not just you that's something that we worked hard to develop while I was there and I really hope that you guys really do have a pride for the team and all of that um, make the most of these last minutes and games you guys have together. Um, it's like, you know, playing under the lights and all that. It could go away for a lot of you and, you know, you never know when you're going to get that back again. It's really special, so make the most out of it. Um, I'm reading off a piece of paper, so if you're wondering why I keep looking. Um, I don't know, you've already put so much pain in and so much sweat and so many hours. Just really leave it all out there and make the most, especially of this game, but, um, live it up and you're going to remember these minutes for the rest of your life so enjoy the 90. Um, I love you Bubba and um, to quote a great man, do work son tonight. Go on Mindy. Where is your boy tonight? I hope he is a gentleman. Maybe he won't find out what I know. You were the last good thing about this part of town.
your back.